All right, Yali, here's a look at run two of the holiday race. job in your your first race of the year conditions were you know not the easiest a loose snow out there did a good job though but a couple things we want to try to work on right here we got a pretty really a wide stance it can't be that wide that's gonna put weight on both skis for sure so because of the weight on both skis and just we're kind of sliding we ended up getting a little low line here so you know better turn there better carving there it was a good job big rut there right Okay. Not bad here. Long outside leg, short inside. We'd like that. You know, a little bit too much hunched over. We talked about that. It's really hard to get the feet off from underneath us um, being hunched over. I know you want to be aerodynamic. I know you feel like you're racing, but we get low a lot of the times by just getting our feet off from underneath us more. see a little bit of the V down there, inside ski twisting. All right, so we're kind of cheating on the, on the inside ski. And remember, we gotta be outside ski to outside ski, rolling them both up, matching edge angles. But overall, again, it's just, it's just too much rotation of the upper body. We've talked about this. So you kind of lead most of your turns. So now you're going to make a left footer turn because that's the dominant foot. And you're really leading and rotating in the direction of the turn. So turning this way causes the hip to go here, causes the skis to go flat and skid. So again, you can see down there really, you know, again, the same thing, rotating in the direction. So. We actually need to rotate a little bit in the opposite direction, counter rotation. All right, so you should be right now really facing, you know, down the hill more, which would be because your skis are are going that way. It would be a little counter rotation. Um, a good general rule of thumb, and let's try to remember this, is to try to face. Um, the downhill tip of your outside ski. So there, your downhill tip of the outside ski is like somewhere right in, well, not drawn well, but you can kind of get right there, sort of. So we should be facing just a little bit in that direction. So let's try to think about our upper body, especially in GS we're talking about here. I want you to face face zipper at the at the ski tip of your outside ski. Slalom, we kind of want it always down the hill, zipper down the hill. But if you could have faced a little bit in, you know, in this direction, a tiny bit, the hip would, would stay a little bit more like this. A great drill for you is the javelin drill. We're gonna or javelin drill where you're gonna pick up the inside ski, cross it over the downhill and make turns. That kind of forces you into a slightly square or countered position. It forces the hip to kind of stay, you know, not 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 rotating with the with the with the ski and the turn. So that is what we should be working on: javelin turns, so we don't rotate as much. Stand up just a hair taller, and make sure we're rolling both skis up on edge at the top of the turn, such that we can't, you know, scissor or diverge or create that V on the inside ski. But like I said, first race of the year, good job.